Latte art is always appear in our daily life. When you sitting in a cafe to enjoy a coffee, or maybe when you searching some social media, you can always see there's many beautiful latte art photos that's taken by the people. But how many people know about the history or the secrets behind latte art? That's why I'm doing this project about latte art culture. So let's get into it, and I hope you enjoyed it. Latte art. Into a square seat. The ocean terminal deck, Harbour City, Simsacher, was chosen as the exhibition venue and will be held in the autumn. As you can see, there's different levels platform that accompanies some other activities between the main pavilion on this side. Also, by the 270 degrees sea view, visitors can enjoy the different moods of this exhibition with the sunset and the night view. The concept of this exhibition is very merged. I use this concept to derive the form and shape. First, place two coffee cups lightly tied together. And then simplify the appearance and spread out horizontally. Finally, add some special and milk foam. And that's it. That's how I developed the exterior design of this pavilion. This is the floor plan, circulation, and zoning. There are a total of five zones: Zone A to Zone E. The details of each zone will explain it later. So now let's get into the walkthrough. The first thing that visitors may see when they arrive at the site entrance area is the reception. They can get the leaflet or ask the question to the staff here when they need help. Keep moving forward, you can see there's a photo taking installation. Also, it will be the icon of this exhibition. And move to the left hand side is the major exhibition area. Let's go inside through the pavilion now. Song A, the emerge, history storytelling. This song using a more interactive way to tell the latter art history to the people. The animation will be projected to connect to the left hand side information display wall by using the gold screen projection. Moving on to the next song is Song B, Boom to Rewind. This song mainly telling the people how the latter art culture spread out from Seattle to other countries. Besides, it also introduces how the history of the espresso from Italy related to latter art. As you can see, there's a display of the first latter art pattern part by using the Magov display stand. About the technology, when the people are standing on the pattern of the floor, the related information will be projected on the wall. Keep walking. The next area is the next part of Song B. The right hand side is the information of one of the proposed partners, which is an association to provide the education and latter art certificate examination. This association also made latter art culture more developed. To the left-hand side is the AR interactive information display of the latte art pattern. Visitors can use their phone to scan the QR code, and they will see the different flooring latte art pattern with the background information. And they can take their photo and review it anytime, anywhere. So C is the technical and chemistry. Do you know the secrets behind latte art? It's more talking about the machinical and chemistry, like the temperature control, the angle of steaming the milk, and the texture of milk foam. So this information will display on the picture or word screen by animation. There's also a transparent touch screen to display the information of the coffee machine. 
can see there's a screen on the floor that displays the milk steaming animation with the soft machinical sound too. Song D, the simulation experience area. The ground floor is D1 and second floor is D2. D1 is mainly playing the simulation experience games. This is using the body movement to play it and it will be more interactive to use this way to free pulling the latter out. After playing the games, the visitor will get a QR code with their present latter art pattern for the next song to use, and the pattern will display it on the installation. As you can see, there's three installation here. About the structure of each installation column, the middle is the middle material to help support the construction of the pavilion. On top of that is the screen to show the animation of milk foam flowing. Let's go up to the stair. You can see there's some artificial coffee beans leaves as the decoration to make the interior more fresher. Zone D2 is the area to watching the following details of different latte art patterns. Before going to the final song, there's a proposed partner information area at the end of the song D1. The right hand side will display a photography and the left hand side is the screen to play the information video. So that's the final song of this pavilion, Song Yi, the AR interactive photo taking area. By using the AR technology, visitors can take photos or video with their present large art pattern with AR animation. To make the design more alive with the natural grass platform from the opposite, they has covered the artificial grass too. That's all about the major exhibition area. Let's go to the next area. It's the limited cafe. After visiting the exhibition, in the end, visitors can go to the limited cafe to enjoy the coffee with beautiful latte art and the pretty sea view. Therefore, it will be make the overall storyline more complete. the end of this video thanks for watching and see you in the next project